So uh, hello everyone and uh, today's video I'm going to show you how to uh, route the um, the Shui VI8. Uh, I think this method works with uh, with any um, Chinese tablet or uh, phone actually. So uh, the problem with this tablet is that when you try to use uh, easy uh, easy route method, it won't work. So you have to do something special for this one, and uh, it's pretty easy. All you need is a computer and a USB cable. So first thing you're gonna download this application. It's called Kingo Root. So here's the link. I will put it in the description. So you just click uh, download like this. And it's gonna download uh, pretty soon. And then uh, once it's uh, completely uh, downloaded, you just install it and uh, I'll show you step by step how it works. So let's wait like a couple of seconds uh, until it downloads. Okay, so it's done now. All you have to do is when the file is completely downloaded, open it. And then uh, install it, so easy thing, uh, I think everyone knows how to do this. Just install it anywhere. <coughs> Sorry. So it's now it's, it's almost done. Now this is only half, half the... Uh, we need another program for the Shui, unfortunately. Like this one, will, this application by itself will work for most uh, Samsung phones and tablets. You know the big companies, but for Chinese, you're gonna have you're gonna need another uh, another application. So for now, I'm not gonna launch it. We need this application, which is called PDA Net Plus. So uh, this is the link. I will put it in the description so all you have to do is press the download for Windows you don't need uh, to buy anything uh, here you go so it's right here version 4.17 again press it and wait for it until it completely downloads so it's almost done now now this one you have to uh, you have to plug your uh, USB in the you have to plug your USB in the computer, and because it's gonna ask you to uh, to plug the uh, the tablet to the PC. So look how how it works. So when you open the installer, it tells you all this stuff. Blah blah blah. You click next, next, and then now it's gonna tell you installing USB driver. So it's gonna give you this menu as you can see it says Motorola, HTC, Samsung LG and since this is not none of them this is a Chinese tablet you have to press others and then press OK now on your tablet this is what you have to do Okay, so on your tablet, this is what you have to do. You have to go to the settings. Where is it? Here. And then go to the... Uh, and then go to uh, about... Where is it? Uh, one second. It's not... Uh, I don't know if you can see... Um, one second, sorry about this. Well... All you have to do is go to the, uh, uh, where is it called, uh, you go to the about tablet, or yeah about tablet, and then press I think uh, kernel version, press it 5 or f 6 times until it says uh, developer options uh, allowed. So once you have the developer options allowed, you go to the developer options, I'm sorry you can't see but my phone is not... Uh, One second. Uh, it's better now, I think. Yeah, 
yeah it's better a little bit now better uh, you have to allow USB debugging mode so press it and then press OK now that you have done that you have allowed uh, developer uh, USB debugging mode <coughs> you take the USB and do plug it to your computer and remember you have to uh, follow the instructions there so see now now that I plugged it in it says installing USB driver setting up blah 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 you just wait for it <coughs> now this is like the the only hard part about it but it's easy see you now now it's done so you just press finish and now you open Kingo root that we installed earlier Where is it? It's opening. See, now it says connecting. Usually, if you don't do the PDA net thing, it says uh, nothing found. But now it's gonna show up. Just little, give it a little bit of time. I already rooted mine, so Ooh, sorry. One second. If it says that, just unplug your uh, tablet and plug it back in should work now uh, one second yep now it works see now on my uh, on my tablet this thing comes up and there you go now uh, since I already done it, see it says here root status yes, it means I already rooted it. So all you have to do now is to, uh, for you you're gonna have to press root, and I'm not gonna do it because I don't want to mess up mine. Uh, so you know, uh, so once you tap root, just you have to leave it plugged like this. You have to leave it plugged. Do not remove it until it says uh, completely. Uh, you know it's completely done if you remove it your your tablet might break I don't, I don't know so uh, it's better if you just leave it uh, until it says 100% uh, completed so yeah that's it that's, uh, it's very easy and uh, I was actually uh, it, it was a little bit confusing at first because no one uh, no one uh, how do you say no one uh, uh, there was no tutorial for the Shui and it didn't work with uh, usual, you know, usual programs that work with uh, Samsung and, uh, you know, all the big companies. But this method worked for me and uh, it should work for you. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you. And uh, I'll put the links in the description so you'll find everything there. So that's it. Uh, have a good one and bye-bye.